one of, one of our long-serving drivers um, had a bit of an issue with um, some flaky skin on the side of his right hand side of his neck behind his ear so he went to his doctors um, and then following some tests they found out that it was actually skin cancer. I did some research and found that um, particularly in America um, they, they've done a lot of research there and found that uh, drivers albeit on the left hand side of the vehicle obviously and left hand side of their bodies had experienced uh, uh, skin cancer in significant numbers when they did their research and this had also been taken up by cancer research in the UK uh, and they had identified that, um, that although the windscreen has is laminated and stops um, the UVB rays and, and UVA rays which are both the harmful rays for skin cancer um, the side windows uh, because they're not laminated uh, they do not uh, stop the UVA rays which um, penetrate deeper into the skin and cause lasting damage and can lead of course to skin cancer. So we spoke to our co local company that does replacement windscreens when we have chip windscreens etc and they said they did have a solution which is a film that can be applied to the inside of the window. The actual cost of this is below £100 per vehicle. We're very pleased to have done this because it's been appreciated greatly by the, by the drivers and it's, we feel it's important to not just be looking at uh, safety around the vehicle in isolation but also be looking at the health and safety of the driver. Yeah, the, the, the hope is that other companies will adopt this across the industry and, uh, and indeed in other industries and ultimately that uh, manufacturers will take heed and start to, to fit it in the factory.